Shabbat Shalom. In this week's Torah portion, there's a verse that says that when you see the donkey of your enemy buckling under its load, and you shall help him. In other words, the Torah says that you may think that because he's your enemy, you won't help him. No, help him, you shall help him. The Baal Shem Tov explains that the word donkey, chamor, is similar to the word chomer, which means material. And that every being is made of two parts, its chomer and its tzura, its material and its form. The human being, our material is our physical body, our animalistic soul, while our form is our godly soul, made in the image of God. Hence the Baal Shem Tov says, and you will see that your body, your animalistic soul, it's buckling under the load of Torah and mitzvahs. And he says that you should know that the body, in its sense, it's your enemy. In other words, man has to search for meaning and purpose, but your body only wants the YOLO, the FOMO, have fun. In that sense, it's your enemy. And you may think to yourself, I need to break this. I need to break my body. I need to break my animalistic soul. Says the Baal Shem Tov, God forbid, for your body is called the work of God's hands. God calls your body my planting, my creation. Hence, do not crush your body. Even when you're mad at yourself, and rightfully so, don't crush your enemy. Rather, embrace the three A's. Number one, A, acknowledge. Help your body acknowledge what it's seeing wrong. Number two, accept. Accept. The body needs to accept that it works on an egocentric format. And then the third A, amend. Let's begin amending from the self-centeredness to caring for others. Shabbat Shalom.